Hey guys, it's Anya Ash and welcome back to my channel. Or maybe I should say, guys, welcome back to my kitchen. Yes guys, so for today's vlog, I am going to cook a very famous Visayan dish which is pork pumba. My niece has been asking me non-stop since last week to cook pork kumba for her. But I was feeling lazy then. But today guys, I am granting her wish. So without further ado, let's start cooking pork kumba. So by the way guys, this is my niece and she loves pork kumba. But she's busy with her choo-choo. <laughs> So here are the ingredients of our pork kumba. Of course, we have the pork adobo cut. And then we have brown sugar. We have pineapple juice. Actually, the enzymes from the, from the pineapple juice will actually make the pork tender and soft. And then we have vinegar and soy sauce, of course. And then we have our garlic, onion, bay leaves peppercorn, calamansi, and also our seasoning. So let's start cooking! So first guys, we'll have to boil our pork so that it is soft and then pork tender. It will take a couple of minutes to do this. So let's just leave it until it's already boiling. So guys, we start cooking now, but first, we have to fry the pork until we reach the, the um, golden brown color, guys. Don't overdo it because mugahi shan. So we just want that golden brown color texture. And I hate this part right here. Kay pisik yun siya. Mahimutang warrior. garlic and the onion make sure to take your time guys so that the flavors would really come out have to mix this guys and then now we can add the soy sauce Then mix. It looks golden. <laughs> Just let it simmer for a couple of minutes. So now we can add the bay leaves and also the peppercorn and then mix. the 
pineapple juice. again for a couple of minutes so now we add the brown sugar it will actually caramelize the syrup I mean the sauce syrup <laughs> and then we add one cup of water and then we add the seasoning minutes to simmer. Happy to show maluto. So guys, put a little bit of salt and then ground pepper and then our calamansi. It's almost done and ready. We just have to wait for a couple of minutes. So guys, I covered it for a couple of minutes to let it simmer. And it's almost done. Here. Digotom na ko. I'm starving. <laughs> A couple of minutes more and it's done. So let's cover it back. So here's our poor kumba. Actually guys, you can also put hard boiled eggs on it. If you like. Almost done. So guys, it's already done and it's chow time. So presenting my pork humba. Kaunta. So let's check if it is already pork tender. Wow. Yummy.